My name is Daniel Hall, and I'm the Assistant Professor of Innovative and Industrial Construction at ETH Zurich. I recently graduated with my PhD from Stanford University in Civil and Environmental Engineering. I was in love with Legos. I probably played Legos more than any other toy um, in, my, in my youth. The idea of taking nothing and creating a building or creating a city out of Legos formed a lot of my early experiences, and it's what motivated me to want to be involved with construction in some way. I like to say that architectural engineering is a marriage of design and structure. And so we have to think about uh, how we hold buildings up, uh, how we create buildings that will do well in earthquake situations and uh, under other stresses like hurricanes. But then we also have to think about how does that integrate with the architecture side of things? How do we make sure that these are also beautiful buildings that people want to inhabit and be a part of? The construction industry is undergoing a digital transformation right now. And so we're seeing this on the design side with digital tools like building information modeling and virtual design and construction. Uh, we're seeing the use of robotics and new industrialized methods both in the factory and on the construction site. There's definitely a need uh, for people that can come in and bring new lines of thinking to code those solutions, to implement those solutions, and to work with uh, existing businesses to make those solutions a reality. As a society, we're facing a, a huge challenge, uh, and that challenge is, is with the energy that we use and, and the way that we house and provide shelter for the citizens of our, of our country and for the citizens of this world. That's a big problem, a huge challenge to solve. And that's where I see young students uh, who are excited about sustainability and reducing greenhouse gas emissions. If we put all that together, I think it's a tremendous challenge, but also a tremendous opportunity um, in the next 25 years to, to tackle. It's really interesting if you talk to people that have worked in the construction field for a while and, and you go walk by a building or, or, or a bridge and they'll almost always say, I built that. And what they really mean is that they worked on a team of hundreds and maybe thousands of people to, to, build, that, to, to build that project. Uh, but there's this sense of pride in that I was a part of this structure that's still standing. If you think about the legacy of uh, the Transamerica building or the Golden Gate Bridge or the Empire State Building, that's a legacy that's passed down for generations. And, and in the construction industry, you can point uh, to a building and tell your grandchildren, like, I built that project, I did that. 